Hey, what's going on guys and gals? Welcome to Heat Signature, out today, September 21st, 2017, on Steam, uh, not Early Access, I was about to say that because I do a lot of Early Access games, but this one, pleasantly, is uh, a complete game, 100% done, and it's by Suspicious Development, the people that made Gunpoint. They provided me with a free code to play this game and share it with you on the channel. This is something that I have to uh, I have to disclose now. And why 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 are you going backwards? There we go. Um, so there it is. I said it. It's free. Thanks to them for providing it to me so that I can show you this game because I think it's pretty darn excellent and I think you guys might enjoy it too. And if you do, there's a link down below in the description that'll lead you to the Steam Store page where you can pick it up for. Well, I don't really know how much it is right now because the game's not unlocked yet. I'm actually playing this about two hours before it unlocks on Steam so that I can coordinate the video release with the game release for maximum effort. Uh, something like that. So it's for Windows only, single player only, although there is some kind of multiplayer added value where you can actually encounter some of your Steam friends' characters that um, they either retire, which you can do here, or if they get killed. And apparently you'll even see one of the items that they carry that they can, uh, apparently if you, you can rename them or something. So you might have like PSJ's long range subverter or something like that. That's pretty cool. But you can only play it single player. Anywho, let's jump in and get into the gameplay. Um, instead of me jawing at you the whole time, it's essentially about breaking into spaceships out here into in outer space, obviously, where the ships are. And you can even liberate these, uh, these space stations that are under the influence of certain empires. Bad, nasty, evil empires. And we're kind of the rebel faction to liberate them and give them freedom. And if you do so, you'll even get, in many cases, a special item unlocked in your shops down here and then you can buy them and you can even find them in missions as well once they're unlocked so that's something that you want to do over a period of time so in fact why don't we do a mission right now let's bring who do we have right now this is Hamill Fox we got all kinds of characters over here uh, we've got four to choose from at any given time and they each have their own stats and history and bankroll and stash and like i said they can't actually die and uh if they do they they go into the legends and retirement zone we've got a few in there already which is pretty cool so yeah they can die this is um you know roguelike kind of thing i guess it's a cross between say ftl and hotline miami at least that's what people say dun, dun, dun. but i don't know i've never played either one of those games i just know uh i like this and well let's get going enough chat let's go who was this guy that i have i don't want this guy i want i want uh yeah hamill fox come on hamill let's go over here and grab a mission so we're in a little space station here oh gosh two missions and they're both bloodless which means i can't kill anyone well that's not true i can kill people but we don't get paid as much they cut the pay if you kill people but this guy has so many good items to play around with I want to show you guys some of the cool tricks we can do on the missions. Uh, here, let's try something. Let's go have a seat. Have a seat. Pick them again. Let's see if we can get... Oh, here we go. Okay. Let's check this one out. Capture Joy Maga. Many sentry guns which we can deal with. Hamill has a couple of very neat devices to handle that. There is an alarm response time, which I don't really like. And a non-lethal weapon required because we have to capture this guy. Means we gotta knock him out, not shoot him. Guards have emergency shields, which are a pain in the butt. Uh, okay, I think I've got a mission here that looks like we can probably complete it without too much trouble. We have to rescue Coma Jounce. I think that's how you say that. No alarm response, thank goodness. This ship has gone rogue and cannot flee to a station if the guards sound the alarm, so we can take all the time we need. But there's a lot of guards. It's not bloodless, which means we can shoot to kill. The guards have regular guns and emergency shields. I don't really like the emergency shields, but we can get around that. And the bosses have regular guns that used to, typically used to shoot people and also emergency shields, but we can do it. All right, so it pays 34 space bucks and it, it works toward our progression for liberating a local station somewhere. And uh, yeah, you have to unlock those, so it definitely helps to do a lot of missions. And here we go. All right, we accept it. 
And now we're just going to go out into outer space. Oh, wait. Let's make sure we have everything. Let's go to our stash here. We got guns that kill. We have quiet guns. And we have a lot of different gadgets to play around with. So many goodies. Yeah. Uh, that's fine. Let's go. In we go. Into the pod. And this is very fluid. We just hop out into space and fly away. No cutscenes. No loading screens. It's all just open space. We might even encounter other ships out here. Occasionally you'll see them floating around. And you can attack them if you want. Uh, I'm not sure exactly what you get. But for me, I prefer the missions so we can work toward liberation. And uh, make some cash. So here's the ship that we are after. And these are all randomly, de uh, de randomly designed. Uh, randomly procedurally generated, what I was trying to say. So they're different every time. So right now I'm in pause mode. You hit space bar, you can stop time and look around and formulate a plan and have a look to see what you're up against oh there's a cargo crate right here Ooh, might find some goodies in there these things explode so they're fun to shoot at when people are around got a bunch of guards here and you can see that they have these emergency shields they're off right now until they hear or spot you if there's some kind of suspicious activity they might turn it on this guy has a key oh this guy has a key too yeah we got to get that one key to get past into these gates under normal circumstances unless we have a teleporter which we might have some teleporters can go through these doors but some don't you need a direct a uh, clear route so we'll take a look at our gear here in a second there's a bunch of guards there and where is the guy we have to capture oh my gosh of course he's on the far side uh, oh no we're, we're, we're actually um, saving this guy right jounce unconscious on the other end of the ship Okay, I don't see any turrets here, which is... Oh, there's one turret. Oh, good. Good, because Hamel Fox has kind of an interesting um, gadget that we can use to turn turrets against the enemy. Oh, hold on. Now we can just pause action anytime we want. We've got a quiet gun in, our, in one hand, which is used with the uh, left mouse button. And we have something else for the right mouse button. A quick, quiet shotgun. Let's make sure we hit this guy when he gets nice and close. Ready? I'm going to hold down the button, which... Oh, gosh! Intruder! <laughs> Here they come! Um, yeah, we're going to have to grab that key and then teleport in there. So we have lots of time to think about this. This is what I like about the pause mode and all these gadgets, because I don't really know exactly what they all do. Sidewinder will teleport us anywhere in the radius as long as there's a clear route. That's not going to help us because we have to get that door opened first. Some teleporters will put you in places without doing that first, but I don't think we have that. Yeah, so we're going to have to deal with this old school style, and that is with shotgun. With our shotgun, most likely. All right, we're going to have to ignore that. Oh, they see the body, and they're wondering what's going on. So if you hit spacebar, you can see what's what they're thinking. Cuba is panicking. Beta is panicking. And uh, this guy is searching. I think we're okay right here. But they are separate, but they're going to turn their shields on. If they turn their shields on, then we might not be able to shoot them. But I think we can do this. Let's uh, open this up. Shoot that guy. and then, Oh, see, he's got a shield up. Dang it. I don't think he can get in here, though. We gotta wait for that shield to go down! Uh, I don't think they can open my ship up. I hope they don't. Shields are still up. We have to wait for the shields to go down. Let's cancel that aim right now. I really don't like these guys with the shields. Okay, it's down. So now we're gonna open the door. And shoot him! And there the fellow's coming. And we'll hide in here again. I don't like this hiding thing. I, I prefer to keep moving forward, but it's the only way to deal with these clowns. Well, one of the ways to do this clause. We'll, we'll try some new stuff later. All right, we've unlocked that door. Oh, you know what? I could have just picked up the key and then teleported. I thought we had to go explicitly walk through it with the key. So that's my bad. We probably could have done that. See, we, we could have picked up the key and then teleported in here because I think that would have been a clear path. I think that's that qualifies. What do we got here? A stealth shield. Oh, these are really nice. Except we're full. <laughs> Dang it. Well, I'm going to grab the stealth shield and use it. Uh, let's replace the crash beam right now. And then the crash beam will hopefully go back to our stash when we leave. Um, well, 
Not sure about that, but let's go. We're going to continue on. The stealth shield is really nice. I'll show it to you in action here in a second. Whoa! There's a whole bunch of guards down there. Uh, let's take care of this guy first. Is he going to come over here? No. I think we can... Got to get that key right there. See that number two key? But I have a special gadget. It is a key cloner, which we can use from here. Beep. Got it. We don't even have to mess with these clowns. Oh, gosh. I think they might have seen me. One of them saw me. So let's uh, quiet gun, right click for the shotgun. And we're going to have to hide. Oh, gosh. Here they come. Dang it. I think we can get this guy quietly. Uh-oh. No, we can't. Okay, now it's time to teleport out of here. Which we can do with the Sidewinder. Got a clear path. Or we can put up our stealth shield that we just got to and they won't see us. But I'd rather just not deal with them. So we're gone. Poof! Gone like a ninja. <laughs> uh, what do we got here? Oh yeah, watch this. We're going to turn this turret into our friend with my very rare and special rechargeable long range subverter. Put that on the right mouse and zap it. And now... It's going to shoot the guards if they get close to it. And I don't know if they're going to get close. We might have to try to get them over there. Oh, they found the body. Yeah, they found the body and they're panicking. Um, we're going to have to get rid of these guys maybe on the way back. I should have hidden that body. Well, at least they're not, they're not coming this way, so we might be okay. I'm going to try to draw these guys out and get them over here closer to the... Uh, Oh, watch this guy. He's got a, he got shot. <laughs> Intruder. Oh, now they're all panicking and running. Let's see what's, what's on his mind. He's searching. Pink question mark means they're searching. They don't know what just happened. And now the turret's going to shoot these guys too. Bam! Another one gone. They haven't figured this out yet, that the turret is trying to kill them. And he's wrecked. <laughs> Did you see him fly? And there's our key. Yeah, we're going to go snatch that key in a second here. This guy's uh, panicked, searching. Shield is down. So we might be able to get him. Or just leave the turret to do it. Oh, here he comes. Use my shotgun. Blam! Blasted. Now we can pick this stuff up. Well, obviously the key, but we can pick up these guns too. Or get ammo from them. Hit space and you can see what's on the ground. In fact, you can teleport anything to you no matter where it is on the ship. That's pretty cool. And we can stash stuff too. So when we leave this ship, whatever we decide to stash will go in our um, permanent stash on the space station. And this one looks like it's already going to go to stash. But I can toggle that on and off. Yeah, see the blue background. Cool! Alright, I'm still learning here. Don't know everything about the game. only got a couple of hours under my belt. But, uh, man, it is a lot of fun, and there's so much to do and see, and many different strategies to try, and gadgets. So if you guys want to see more, let me know, because we're just barely scratching the surface here. All right, so, oh, there's a, a level 4 key here? Holy smokes. All right, hit the space. If you hold down shift when you're in um, pause mode, you can look around the map. I don't know if I had mentioned that earlier. So that is, is that a four? That's a four, a sideways four. We need to get this dude's key to get over there. Uh, we've got a bunch of guards here. I think I can steal his key and then teleport. Yeah, we can steal this guy's key right here. We got a key cloner, we, got, we can use it three times. Thanks for the key, dude. Now, and he's none the wiser. And now we can teleport all the way over to Jounce, see if we can get a little closer. Because that's a clear route now. But I don't think I can get past these guys. I'm not sure what kind of range we have. Um, I used to have a swapper that allowed me to swap positions with guards, but it doesn't look like I have it anymore. Visitor just sends you to place for two seconds, then you come right back. So that's not going to be useful here. Stealth shield. Well, let's teleport past these guards. And then we might have to shoot that guy. Here's... How far can we go? Oh, it's... It's blocked? Why is that blocked? Oh, that's not blocked there. Okay. I was just out of range. Alright, moving on. Is there anybody else up here that we have to worry about? No! 
We're in the clear. No more guards. We just have our target. We're here to save you. Come with us. Uh, he's unconscious. He can't hear us. Oh, by the way. Oh, jeez. Someone's coming. Hold on. Let's get this guy. Let's get this guy. Let's get... <laughs> Sometimes they can hear the shot. Oh, he... oh, he's so far. Whoa. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Eh. Yeah. He's about to shoot us. And I'm not sure if we can get away. Uh, stealth shield. Maybe we can disappear right fast. Yes, 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 we can. Woo! We went poof right in front of his eye. <laughs> oh, man. See, he hears the shot before the bullet reaches him, and he puts up his shield. It's crazy. Yeah, so we have to think about that as well. All right, let's pick up our friend here. Well, it's not our friend. We don't really know who he is, but he's the current job. Now, this guy is still investigating. We're going to have to get through there because we can't carry him and teleport at the same time, unfortunately. So, what are these things? All right, well, let's put him down right here and let's try to take care of these clowns. I'm going to do that stealth shield again, which was pretty darn good. We have another one here. Two of them. All right, here we go. He's coming, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. Shield is down. Shield is down. Bam! All right. You didn't hear that bullet fast enough. Wrecked him. Now they're going to see the body. Oh, they didn't even hear it. Oh, boy, he's going to see the body. Yep, here he comes. Oh, dang it. Oh! Uh. Oh, did somebody just teleport? Oh, no! He sees me. Get out of the, get out of the way. I don't think they can kill this guy, but I don't want them to even be close to him. Uh, shucks. All right, let's do... There's two of them now. I'm going to do the shotgun here. All right, let's get this guy as soon as he turns his back. That was not the shotgun, but it did the trick. Oh, he's got a shield up. He's going to see the body. Investigating. That's the shotgun. All right, now let's move the body. <laughs> This is a pretty big ship. It's taken a long time. I hope we have enough time to do some other things. I want to show you as much of this game as I can in the short amount of time that we have here. There's only one guy left. I think we can wreck his face. Oh, we might even walk over to our turret. Oh, you know what? Just shoot. Oh, jeez. Shoot the pilot. Almost woke him up. Oh, <laughs> the turret got him. Thanks, turret, for the backup. Appreciate it. Man, do they fly when the turret kills them. I think that's every... Oh, no, there's two guards left. These are the guys that we teleported past, right? If I shoot over here, they might come in to investigate, and then my turret can handle them, but I think we can sneak right past. Yeah. We're out of here. We made it! We made it! There's nobody left, right? What is this down here? Armor-piercing rounds. Oh, yeah, those are good to have. All right, stay right there. And now it's time to boogie. You don't want to fly in front of the guns of these ships. They actually do have guns. Where is it? I'll just show you right quick because you'll get blasted out of the sky. Those little cones in the front. Yeah, hold on. Oh, oh, the ship's off. It's flying. <laughs> it's flying into outer space. There's no pilot because I shot him. All right. Well, goodbye. Now let's head back. Hold down F key to speed things up. And we'll go deliver our charge. And that was a successful mission. Very excited. Here we go. All right, let's drop him right here. Bloop. And now the mission is complete. We rescued him. Jounce. Killed 15 crewmen. We harmed him at the same time, I guess. And we got paid for it, too. All that fun. And we got paid for it. And we um, got a little bit of progress toward liberation. Let's have a look at the liberation screen. So, yeah, all these we can liberate now. I had to unlock those by doing missions in the area. And it looks like it's just going to spread out from here. So when you do these missions, you usually take control of a, a different character, like a defector, like this one right here. Unlock a defector, and you get special gear for that particular mission. And when you complete that mission, that liberation, um, some of these will unlock items. Like this one right here unlocks a concussion hammer. And if that's unlocked, that means it's unlocked forever. We can sometimes find them on missions, and we can also buy them from our shops. Our shop in here like down here so if we when we unlock that concussion 
um, hammer. We're going to be able to buy it somewhere around here. I'm not sure exactly where. I'll probably. Oh, here it is. Overpriced concussion hammer. That's a different one. This is not a permanent item. That's just uh, a random thing that pops up every once in a while. But man, overpriced concussion hammer. Look at that thing, guys. 120 buckaroos. Uh, that would be really nice. Quick recovery. That's a rare hammer. But if we unlock the regular concussion hammers, they'll show up here and be a heck of a lot cheaper, obviously. But that that's actually something I might want. But but I'm at 96% of my personal mission cost. So every character has their own personal mission and you have to get 200 space bucks to, uh, to unlock it. And I only need to do like one more mission to get it. But that is pretty sweet. I'll just have to do more missions. Let's buy it. Oh, yeah. Concussion. Overpriced concussion hammer. <laughs> oh, it sure is. All right. I think we're going to call it quits right here, guys. Um, I think we're out of time. That mission took a lot longer than I had anticipated. But uh, I think you get the idea what this game is all about. Um, if you want to see more, let me know. And I'll be glad to show you some more and do some different mission types and show you some new characters maybe do a liberation and i want to show you this right here this everything gun let's just go do the everything gun in the uh practice terminal yeah just just give me a random easy so anything that happens in here is uh not permanent it's like vegas you know what happens here nobody cares oh shoot oh there's nothing to shoot yet oh gosh all right well we gotta use a concussion shot first so this everything gun is a special item that is only around for a short period of time. You can get it by finding a ship with a flashing strobe flying around space. And you have to complete the mission in there or at least steal the, uh, the cargo and you'll get this everything gun. Um, I want to do it right now if there's anybody left. This is an easy mission though. Oh, there's nobody around. <laughs> Only two dudes. Uh, well, let me show you what it does. So if you shoot it, if there's stuff on the ground... It just shoots all the stuff around. It's just kind of fun. I don't know how effective it is. Oh, gosh. almost knocked myself out. But, yeah. It's called the Everything Gun. It's going to go away eventually in like a couple of weeks. And you'll never be able to get it again. But once you unlock it, like I have done here with this particular character, I'll always have it in the game. Like, it'll show up randomly in shops um, and also in certain missions. So, start practice. Oh. We do another one. Yeah, let's uh, let's shoot this guy, and then we'll shoot this guy with the everything gun. Oh, jeez, I missed. Try that again. Everything. There's not much here on the ground. Shoot at him. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Got it with one wrench. Ow! I just totally knocked myself out <laughs> with the everything gun. I didn't know you could do that. It bounced off the wall, and whacked me in the face. That's clap. Oh, <laughs> I did it again. Oh, when will I ever learn not to shoot the everything gun in close in close spaces? <laughs> oh, that's great. I love it. Okay, well, I think with that, we're going to have to call it quits. Let me get out of here before somebody gets hurt. That's the everything gun. Um, and I think it is... I think it's only available for the one character that finds it in his stash or on his person. But if it's unlocked, pretty much anybody can get it, like I said, either in a mission or in uh, one of these shops eventually. It might show up occasionally. It's not something that's always there. It's just kind of random. So, yeah. And I'll, maybe I'll do a video and show you how to get that. It'll be pretty quick and short. Um, all right. I guess we're done here. Hope you guys enjoyed, and we'll see you next time. Once again, this is Heat Signature by Suspicious Development. Um, they gave me the code for this. It was free. I have to mention that. I think I mentioned it in the beginning. I'm not sure, but just in case, there it is. And uh, link down below in the description. It should be available right now, today, September 21st, 2017. Um, enjoy. Have a good day. Bye-bye.